Hey guys, this is Ina, and today we'll be creating this typography animation in After Effects. We have a lot of things to do, so let's get started. Hey guys, so today I'm gonna to show you how I created this animation in After Effects. So let's get started. So first create a new composition by clicking Ctrl N and create a solid layer. And I want my background to be red. I'm just going to write the word guts and I used the Arial Black font. Then I'm just gonna make sure it's centered and I'm going to import this illustration that I downloaded. I'm going to duplicate this layer that I created and I'm gonna automate the illustration to the new layer that I created. Great, so I'm just gonna scale it down a little bit. The next thing would be to change the position of the, the text layer. So I have this black shadow behind it. Next, I'm going to convert the, this text to a shape layer. In the search option here, I'm just gonna write down path and I'm gonna add a keyframe for each of these path options. Then I'm gonna start making adjustments. So essentially what I'm doing here is just moving each letter a bit to the to the right and a bit up and i'm gonna just do the same thing for all these letters when i'm ready i'm just gonna adjust the graph and then i'm going to use a very handy plugin that's called copy ease it's a free plugin that you can download the link will be in the description below and then when you install it click on window and select the copy ease plugin then i'm gonna select the keyframes of the g letter and then i'm gonna click copy i'm gonna select all these other keyframes and click paste so what this plugin does is it copy and pastes my uh, value graph and my speed graph to all these other keyframes so i don't have to do it four times want to improve your after effects skills exercise and get feedback from other animators join my membership program the link will be in the description below next i'm just going to start creating shapes so I want this uh, movement to be more realistic. So I'm going to be adding extra shapes so I can complete the letters so they can look a bit more 3D. So just create all these shapes. And then from there, I would need to make some adjustments and animate the path again. My sign looks 3D and I'm just gonna type path again in the search panel. I'm gonna add a keyframe for every little shape that I created. Then I'm gonna go at the start of the composition and start adjusting these shapes. I'm adjusting these shapes in the first keyframe and then I'm gonna copy and paste this keyframe. The last thing would be to offset the keyframes and I'm gonna start by uh, offsetting the letter, like the, the keyframes for the letters and then I'm gonna offset the other little shapes that I created. Don't forget to copy and paste your value graph again with this plugin to the other shape layers. So you can make sure the movement is consistent. The last thing would be to just add a position keyframe for this illustration. That's the mask below the text. And, and I'm gonna adjust the speed graph again. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If so, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for your time and I'm gonna see you next week.